Wolf is awarding $54 million to various renovation projects across the state. Your county, which happens to be his home county, gets by far the biggest chunk at $19 million. Jeremiah Marshall got a look at one landmark that will benefit. The Appel Center for the Performing Arts. The building is almost 100 years old, and workers say that's going to take a lot of maintenance, and these funds will help. It's been a protracted process for us. The Appel Center for the Performing Arts received $2 million, and workers. Let's look, we'll go through right over here. Showed us what's on the list for upgrades from a new havoc system to fixing water damaged walls and repainting chip ceilings to a bigger concessions area and new lighting. The industry, like many others, are moving to LEDs to other instruments. CEO and President Todd Fogdahl says that's just the inside. I think these doors could go back to the 1940s. Really? Yes. The building will need a facelift. The mural will too. The nonprofit in York isn't the only one awarded with assistance. So hearing the news, oh my gosh, we are jumping for joy. I'm so excited that this project is actually moving forward. That project, a $4 million African American History and Cultural Center. We want this museum to be a place where those discussions can still happen. We can still make changes and improve the inclusivity of our community. And we're looking to those future generations to do that. The money for this three leveled museum will be filled with exhibits, pictures, and education on social justice, segregation, and contributions from African American natives of York and beyond. We're hoping this museum will add to the other museums that are in the area and really be a cornerstone for that African American history, a way to create a path for people to move from museum to museum and really get the full breadth of history. And both nonprofits say it's going to take some time to get things up and running. And officials with the Performing Arts Center say it's going to take years to make sure everything is completed, but they say these funds are a step in the right direction. Reporting in York, Jeremiah Marshall, ABC 27 News. Thanks, Jeremiah. Also in York County, Cadora's Greenway gets $10 million and Roth's Church Road Community Partnerships gets $3.2 million. The Adams County Historical Society Museum gets $2 million.